We're just about to leave on the first van excursion. Got the van all packed up. Check out Dan's new shirt. It's a pretty plain shirt. There's not much to see. It looks good though. That's right. You look like you're ready. Ready? Up. Up. Good up, girl. Okay, babe. How excited are you? Super excited. Not okay. excited about filling up with gas. That's going to be expensive. So guys, this is our first trip in the van. I'm really excited to go with Dan. We're going to Estes Park because I have a wedding planned. We decided to make a trip out of it and we're just gonna have like a few days of fun. So, yay! Her pen being so good. We're just now leaving Fort Collins. Windshield. Our, our windshield fluid doesn't work right now, so I just left uh, <laughs> left it wet and I'll wipe it with the wipers here. I'm gonna try and find some good dispersed camping spots. I was looking on campsites.net and iOverlander. I think I found a couple good options, so we'll we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Ready? Are you ready to get there? I was just saying to Dan that I'm super excited to be living in a van because we can pretty much be wherever we want or like go where the weddings are. And that's just super exciting. If we had a wedding in Crested Butte, I could be there the night before or like two days before we could hang out in town and then I could go film a wedding and like I don't have to drive all the way home. So that's just really awesome to think about. Hopefully one day. Places. What's happening? Oh, well. oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Kona! Kona down. Kona. We're on a bumpy road. We're so close. This is crazy. I wasn't sure if maybe I did turn wrong and I was supposed to come in from the other way. I just did not expect to be coming to like a date. in the road and we just got out and decided to walk up it and it's a good thing we did because all the spots are taken up until right up there there starts to be some snow on the road so we're not gonna try that we're gonna go back and then walk down the other fork and see if we can find anything here okay. parking spot now it's a little chilly the sun's about to go down Dan's like running off in the distance here hi Dan but hold on <laughs> y'all are so cute She's, she has so much energy. She's pulling to try and come back to you. Hey, you want to go with her? Hi, girl. Want to sit? So we went up the other fork. Unfortunately, we didn't really find any parking spots to park the van overnight. So I think we're going to head back to Estes Park. And then I think we'll just stay the night there. Yeah. yeah. Sounds good. <laughs> so it seems like this way is mostly like cabins and private property up up on this fork so nothing for us to stay and then yeah like danielle said we're gonna head back to estes park and when they have an area like a fairground campground that you can just pay like ten dollars and stay there won't be glamorous van life but it'll be realistic van life so that's what we'll do for tonight look at them in the background Puppy's a little wet. yeah okay we'll see you guys we just got to the parking lot and got it all to ourselves Yay! Like no one's nothing, here. Nothing but <laughs> and how much is it tonight? Ten dollars. Just ten dollars so nice, yeah. for a night stay nice in a parking lot under the mountains. Yeah. It's nice that we had this to fall back onto because we couldn't find something at the other place. So yeah. Yeah. And both Dan and I are really excited because this will be our first night in the van. That's right. Okay, we just got back 
from our hike. Coffee shop. Coffee shop. She was too right under this mountain. It's beautiful. Now Dan and I are gonna head out to the coffee shop and get some work done. She doesn't like it. <laughs> Hi Kona. Kona can't ever leave us. driving me over. That's right. We have portraits today in Rocky Mountain National Park, which will be really beautiful, hoping that it doesn't rain. Gonna arrive to the venue a little bit early so we can get a little bit of B-roll and just meet all the other vendors before the whole day gets started, so. today. Boing, 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 boing. Everyone's like, this fan. There's this fan. So right now I'm just figuring out where to set up my gear. I just dropped Danielle off at the venue. Now I have a couple hours. I do need to be on standby. I think Danielle told you, but they are going to Rocky Mountain National Park, which is about a half hour from the venue. And they're doing that, I think, at one o'clock. So in case Danielle is not able to get a ride with someone else, I need to be close by to come and pick her up and take her over there. The plan for me for today is after I'm done, Filling up the tires with a little air. I am gonna grab some lunch and just probably sit around and watch some YouTube. Okay, so I just got my lunch. I've been craving big fat burritos. So that's exactly what I got myself. This is what we're looking at for lunch. Good and smothered, looks so good. After that, I am gonna probably take Kona on a hike. All right, so we just, Kona and I that is, just started a walk after getting confirmed we don't need to drive Danielle and now it started snowing like crazy but it doesn't see too severe it's not hail at least but yeah should be a good little hike hopefully it doesn't get too much worse as we get further in I'm gonna enjoy it 10 minutes after I just told you guys we're gonna try and enjoy that hike we're back in the van it just started thundering like crazy and although I didn't really see maybe like one or two lightnings um, we could just tell the thunder was really really close uh, so we had to get out of there. Fortunately, it looked like a really nice hike. Maybe we can get back tomorrow. Uh, so we got to get down off this mountain before the roads get really bad and we start sliding all over the place. Look at this. It's just madness out here raining and all sorts of crazy traffic. So right now I am heading back to the free parking spots that I know of hoping to be able to find something for free and then just kind of hunker down. But yeah, we'll just hunker down, hang out with Kona, find some YouTube videos, and uh, wait until later today, hopefully it clears up. Oh, no, I don't think I can make that turn. <laughs> All right, we'll go right up here. I ended up getting my coffee. Uh, just one of those days, it's like a cozy, rainy, you know, overcast day. I actually wish I would've brought my journal. I normally don't journal very often at all, but I definitely feel like I could do that a little bit today. But I don't have it, so instead we're gonna curl up with coffee and Kona over here. Sleeping her little head away. Sleeping the day away, this one. Just finished filming. How was your day, Dan? It's great. It's relaxing. And, um, sure, okay. <laughs> 
<laughs> you had a good one though? Yeah, there's a lot of walking and then sitting around in the van. <laughs> in Kona. Hi baby. She's a wet dog. But we had so much fun. No. Oh my god, the dog will in the street. You're so little. Okay. All right, guys, so we are back in Fort Collins. This has actually been, it's like two weeks later, so I'm like editing the vlog now and realized we didn't really sign off or anything, but we had a really fun trip. I have been filming a ton of weddings and like this next weekend I have two weddings coming up, so maybe I can get some more BTS of that. And yeah, we're hoping to like take more trips into the future into the future in the future um yeah i'm really excited it's been fun we really we're happy to take you guys along for at least a little bit of it so yeah hope you enjoyed this vlog and we'll see you next time see ya. <laughs>